Hey, what's up? It's Ben here. So today I want to give you guys a quick update on my cash and care put and cover call portfolio. I'm not sure if it's going to be quick or not because I'm going to be doing a couple of trades and I do apologize about the background noise. If you do hear it, the gardener outside is doing its thing. So right now, currently the market is down about over a percent and I'm assuming the market is going to continue to fall since December is here and everybody's decides to sell in the last in the fall in the fall half of the year. Anyways, uh, so my current portfolio right now is Pinterest and Palantir. Currently, Pinterest, uh, I have an uh, option on Pinterest, and it got expired, you know, on December or November 25th. That got expired. It didn't get assigned. I got the money, so you, so yay for that. So I'm going to put close on that. So as of now, I'm still holding 400 shares of that. Okay, that Pinterest is killing me. I want to let it go. Cost basis is $33.44. Uh, so that's for Pinterest. Palin's here right over here. I have 200 shares of that and it's currently still hanging there. December 16th is the expiration day. Uh, I'm actually going to exit that position because I'm above the 70% uh, return uh, on that. So I am going, first things first, I'm gonna just go ahead and find mm, Palantir, where's Palantir right over here. So Palantir right over here, tra currently trading at $7.17. Uh, so if I were to go on options, I'm gonna go ahead and close that out and this is good practice for you guys if you guys are doing this uh let me see let me find when is it december 16th right over here <clears throat> there you go right over here so i got two uh options right over here i'm gonna go ahead and click this so right over here i'm gonna be just be buying back quantity i'm gonna hit two uh limit price let's see um four dollars ideal mid price four dollar last price was four 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 cents four dollars yeah so let's go ahead and actually it's eight okay so maximum loss eight right over here but that isn't an issue and then everything seems right bye and it went through so here we go let's go right over here palantir right over here average price four cents in this case four dollars per option so in this case i have two so it's gonna be eight let's double check total two yes and then i'm gonna just fill this out and so you know what it is so there you have it i went ahead and closed out this position from last time uh that i had open so right now it's currently currently closed close it out with a uh with a strike of nine as well december 16 expiration I went ahead and uh, bought it back at 0 0.04, in this case, $4 uh, per, per option, and then times that by two, so it's $8. So I made around, the difference is around at $58 on this uh, transaction. So there you go, There, there's that one, and then I'm gonna go ahead and jump back onto Palantir and then do another transaction because I wanna get rid of this thing uh, ASAP. So I'm, I'm back on here, I'm gonna be doing a call again, uh, so this is this time I'm going to do 25 day expiration and then really close to the market price. So it's currently it's trading around seven, 716, right? I'm going to do 750. If it executes, great, because right now, uh, if not, then whatever, whatever. So Delta is 0.41. So right now, uh, the probability is pretty high uh, that it might get executed or if not, or get a sign. If not, then oh, well. So right now I am just gonna go ahead and do a sell right over here and I'm gonna be doing two as well. So type in two. So the price I wanna be at is, let's do 0.3. If it gets in, if it gets in, if not, then oh well. So that my maximum profit, or in this case, it's going to my account, is about $60. If I have to adjust it, well, well, I'll, lose, I'll get probably $58 around here so hopefully it gets filled if not still holding strong over here uh let's go ahead and just place an order and see if it gets filled yeah go ahead and sell actually it went pending okay so what i'm gonna do is go in here click on modify good exercise for you guys continue doing this go ahead and click modify if it doesn't get filled drop the price a little bit so 0.29 it's gonna get filled for sure because buyers are right now buying at 0.29 so modify, sell, and it did, it went through, if you hear that noise. So right now, I got filled at 0.29 right over here, two, average 0.29. I'm gonna go ahead and fill this out real quick. 
So there you have it. I have it filled out for a strike of 0.75 uh, or point or 7.5 uh, strike and an expiration date with a 20 23rd on December. Two options in this case, 0.49 and then total that went into my account is $98. Uh, and then I'm going to leave that one as is and then Pinterest. Let's go back to Pinterest since I have nothing going on with Pinterest right now. So Pinterest, uh, let's go check. Actually, let's just go check the price right now. I only have like a couple more minutes before the, uh, the market closes. So Pinterest P I N S right now. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Right now it's trading around my stock price is 2430. I'm going to go ahead and do a. A cover call let's do a cover call on this one let's do a 25 day same thing as palantir scroll down right now it's trading let's see full 40 40 okay so one one dollar and 34 let's see one dollar and 34 mid price 138 i think i could get 130 on this okay let's go ahead and try to do this one uh right now i'm gonna do, do uh, be doing four four right over here i'm gonna do let's see do four Let's do four options right over here and limit price. Let's see one. Let's be one, 1.39. I want to be a little bit greedy. 1.39 over here. Let's see if it executes on 1.39. Oh, let's see. Let's see. Actually it's sell. I don't know why I had to buy 1.39. That's why it's important. So 1.39 potential uh, profit. It's 556 that's good but at the same time uh if i get a sign and then it goes bye bye uh let's see right now uh everything checks out good uh let's see mid price one point mm, yeah let's let's go 1.3 i think it's gonna get it's gonna get filled actually it didn't get filled wow interesting okay let's go 1.3 1. 1. 1.37 let's go 1.37 so I'll go back to working right over here click modify 1.37 sell and it went through so it went go on filled right over here I have let's go all the way back four that got filled and then the average price is 1. 1.1.38 actually which is good which is even better uh, right now I'm gonna go ahead and fill this up for you guys and there you have it. So right now, currently have a uh, expiration at twenty on December twenty third with a strike of twenty four and twenty four dollars and fifty cents right over here. Four hundred shares, aka four uh, options right over here. Credit one point three eight, and I got five hundred and fifty two dollars into my account as of now. But actually, I've been thinking. I was just thinking earlier when I was filling this out, I should go back to Palantir and actually do another trade. Palantir. PLTR right over here. I'm gonna do, since I have only a couple more minutes uh, before the market close, I'm, I'm gonna do a buy, actually. I'm gonna do a a cash to cure put. Let me do, let's just do a cash to cure put on this one. I know this is uh, taking longer than usual. I'm gonna be rushing. I have only a couple minutes. Uh, let's see, cash to cure put. Uh, let's go down to, let's do 25 days, actually. 25 days let's do do you think it's gonna go below six dollars and fifty cents actually uh, let's go yeah if it goes below six dollar uh, 650 yeah I'll, I'll just go ahead and buy if it if it does dip below that so I'm gonna go ahead and do two uh, so two two options I'm gonna be selling and then for right now the price let's see one point uh, let's see, 0. 0.16, 0. 0.16. Uh, is that a good? Is that a good deal? 0. 0.16, 0. 0.16. Uh, okay, I think I think Delta is 0. 0. 0.23. Usually I'm looking for 0. 0.3, so this is a little bit lower, so I'm getting less payout. Uh, so it's whatever. I'll I'll just do it for the sake of doing it, just doing it. So I'm gonna go ahead and take a profit of 32. I think it's gonna go through. I have a feeling it's gonna go through. Okay, let's go. Cash secure put. Yeah, actually, actually went through. So right now, let's go on the field to Palantir 0.16, and I did two. So I'm gonna do a cash. 
secure put. Oh, by the way, let me change this. This was a cover call. I don't know why I put CSP. So cover call right over here. And cash secure put, and it's a 6.5 strike December 23rd. So there you have it. I did another two right over here, even though I want to get rid of uh, pounds here, but I'm just going to go ahead and do it. Anyways, if, if all else fails at the end of the year, right next to, you know, before December 30th, I'm going to just, you know, just sell them all. <laughs> let's see if that happens. Uh, I'm not sure uh, what that's going to be, but let's add all, all, actually all the income for today that I made. So 98 plus 32 plus let's see go back to pins 552 that's equal to 682 dollars for the income for today so there you have it i did a little bit i know this video took a little bit longer than usual but hope you guys enjoy this you know keep on learning on your uh wheel strategy cash secure put you know cover call do it all you can if you want to watch my videos i'll link them down below like tutorials and how to set up uh you know formats like this templates all of it is down below and by the way if you haven't had Weibo yet feel free to check them out you know download their app fund their accounts and you don't even have to trade and don't even use your own money all you have to do is just put a dollar in it and so then you could get actually get the free stocks that they offer and by the way uh if you do get the free stocks you know Go just, you know, sell them all and then get some money. I think you could get a couple dollars. Well, actually more than a couple dollars since I got like, oh, probably over $50 or so uh, once I open them, when, when I open my account, but everybody's different. Maybe you could get 200, maybe you could get, you know, you know, $10, but it's free money. If you don't want to even trade, just hop over to, uh, you know, the paper trading uh, platform that they have. It's really beneficial. You could trade options with it in there as well. So anyway, if you have any questions, drop a comment down below and I'll, uh, get back to you as soon as possible. Anyways, I'll catch y'all next week.